On February 11, 2009, someone called Satoshi Nakamoto announced to the internet that he had created a completely decentralized open source P2P eCash system. Yep, Bitcoin. But no one really knew who Nakamoto was in real life until yesterday when Newsweek reporter Leah McGrath Goodman outed the person she thinks invented the world's most successful digital currency. This guy, 64-year-old Dorian Prentice Satoshi Nakamoto. And then shit got crazy. Journos showed up at the physicist slash engineer slash computer genius slash model train enthusiasts home in Temple City, California. He told them he was ready for a free lunch. Why did you create Bitcoin, sir? Okay, no, no questions right now. I want my free lunch. <laughs> sir, can we ask you about no, Bitcoin? No, Why no, were you no, involved no, no, in Bitcoin? Okay, I'm not involved in Bitcoin. Okay. Who's involved in Wait Bitcoin? Wait a minute. I want free lunch first. I'm gonna go with this guy. He hopped into a light blue Prius and drove off with Ryan Nakashima, a reporter at Associated Press, and they did have lunch at Mako Sushi in Arcadia. But the pack kept after them, and finally they took refuge at the AP's headquarters in Los Angeles. And while the journos on the outside tweeted shuffled and selfied, Nakamoto and Nakashima talked for two whole hours. Then Nakashima announced that Nakamoto said that he is not the man behind Bitcoin after all and hadn't even heard of it until three weeks ago, which no one believes. But he is trying. And then the interwebs went ablaze with Geekspew. So what do you think? Is it him? Angliski. Well, you're in there now.